Hello guys, and welcome back to another Bejeweled 3 playthrough. Now, you might notice something different. My name is different. Well, here's the funny thing. I was supposed to do something, but... You see, something went wrong in my original file. And um, uh, the reason why, because I recorded first footage, but I didn't like it at all. The audio was messed up, and... A lot of shit, so I made a second file to redeem this because, well, you want to know what we're going to be doing today? Yes, we're going to be doing quest mode, the story mode of the game. Now, here's the reason. If you're wondering why they're all not unlocked again, well, I have to start the new file, okay? So, let me tell you about quest mode. It's the story mode of the game. A couple of relics have been, I think, placed under a curse, and... What you have to do in quest mode is retrieve those relics, so... Yeah, I've been excited. We're gonna do the adventure mode of the game. And let's hope the audio isn't messed up this time. So this is the quest mode screen. And it says up here, if you look closely, Complete quest to restore the lost relic of Bejeweled. I don't know what Bejeweled is supposed to be. I think it's supposed to be the ancient kingdom of this game. Maybe that's how the game fits in with the title? But anyway, you see this relic over here? This is the relic in its outside shape. As you see, there are four holes. Your job is to complete one of these four, four levels over here. Then, when you complete it, a gem will go into these slots. Complete four of them, you restore the relic partially. So. What we're gonna do first in the quest is we're gonna do a level. Now, depending on how the recording goes, we'll do a certain amount of levels each time, so yeah. What I'm gonna be doing today is butterflies, our first quest. Be prepared, people. Okay, we'll give you a small hint to what the quest is about. Butterflies move up a space every turn. Match 15 butterflies. I'm sorry guys, but I need to pause. Man, that was embarrassing. My brother once again walked in on me. Okay, like it said before I'm interrupted, butterflies move up a space every turn. 15 butterflies, not 15 butterflies freedom with special gems. You don't have to use special gems, but anyway, here's the thing. There's a spider on here like I did with David. Well, we already did this before, so God damn it. Forgot, because I started a new file that happens. Alright, so the total recording doesn't get screwed over like it did last time. I'm sorry guys, but my recording, the audio was screwed. I'm serious. Okay, so yeah. Oh man, I'm not getting that much stuff to talk about. That's usually bad. Oh, like NCS said. Doesn't matter, just keep talking. Do not count this as a let's play. Grandpa Romania will get mad at me. Well, he doesn't know me. But still. I watched Grandpa Romania's video, and I intend to think he's right. Don't count this as a let's play, people. Do not. It's just a playthrough. I'm doing this to show the awesomeness of the game. Alright, so we have... How many butterflies do we have freed? Oh yeah, I forgot to mention this. This flower thingy will tell you how many butterflies you freed. And sometimes there will be a hint of the quest in case you need to know what you're doing again. Like, they really kind of expect you to go like, what the fuck am I doing again? And they'll do that. Man, I usually make the game look exciting. I bet I'm not doing that right now. Star gem. There, now we got something. Remember, do not be afraid to put the- Oh! He actually gave me something good this time. These hints, they don't help that much, but they will do sometimes. Hints will do what they have to do. That's life of the hints. There we go. One more butterfly. Let's hope we can free it. 
Make your moves smart, Emilio. Or Kirby. Whoever. Okay, here's the thing. Facebook, I'm called Emilio. YouTube, I'm called Kirby. And the quest is completed! Now, you notice something. Every time you complete a quest, it loses its rocky texture and turns into a smooth, round orb. That's That just shows that you completed the quest. Any quest that still has a rocky texture around it will have a rocky texture, so... Any quest you completed will become a round orb. You can replay the quest if you want to, but... That's only if you really want to. How much time are we in? Five minutes. Still have enough time. Alright. Next, we're gonna be doing Gold Rush. Yes, if you saw the trailer, this is the mining. Mine gems near dirt. Okay, I can explain it better. What they want you to do is match gems near the dirt, and that will help you dig. The concept might sound idiotic, but it's actually a good idea. It's pretty fun. Hypercube. Hypercube's the best gem in the game. And I'm already done! See how game-breaking Hypercubes can make this? Yeah, Hypercubes the best. You want to get them anytime you can. That was pretty quick, we can do another one. Archimele. Turn the grids to gold before time runs out. What they want you to do here, they want you- they, you're under a time limit and you have to turn all this lead into gold. There we go. Doing good so far. It doesn't matter about hypercubes now, people. What you have to do is match. God. And... I'm already done. That was easy! Normally, that isn't that easy. But vertical matches can make it so much easier. How much time do we have now? Seven minutes. So good. So... Now, before we film the last slots, we're gonna do something called Staramax. However you pronounce that. It's where you have to clear a certain amount of gems within a certain amount of moves. It's my favorite out of the personal. Now here's the thing. You have to replay some of these quests. But they will be called like Butterflies 2, Gold Quest 2, something like that. Okay. So, Staramax it is. You know, it wants you to clear swoop one this time around it wants you to clear 120 gems within 20 moves. Or less. Let's do it. Yeah, try to go for special gems. They'll clear more. I thought I was gonna get the flame gem this time, did you? Star gems, they just clear more gems than flame gems. Well, my personal opinion. That's what I want you guys to figure out. Do not be afraid to click the hint button. It might not help that much, but if you're stuck, then it's a good idea. Okay, I'm gonna go for the power gem here. Whoa, two of them for the price of one! Alright, this is gonna be good. I'm already done. And... Beautiful. And we unlock Diamond Mind! Okay, so now we continue. We can go to the next one, but... Wait. Hold the phone. There's still four slots. Look where I'm pointing at my mouse. Still four slots? Oh, oh, what can this mean? Just what? Mysterious. 